Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Excel. In this module, I want to show you how you can automatically add a record to a list. So on the right, I have a list of staff. I've added a new member of staff here. I want to click this button and add it to this list. So you've got two greens there. So I'll just change this to black so you can see that this is actually changing. So I'll change that details add the record so black comes at the top so all I've done here is record a macro of myself doing that and that's what I want to show you how to do so first of all you need to make sure you can get or see the developer tab if you can't see the developer tab just right click on any other tab customize ribbon and when you get options coming up make sure this developer tab is ticked I'll just cancel that off because I've obviously got that on here and then what I'm going to do is record a macro of myself importing the data into this table. So record macro, and I'll leave it as macro 2, but you can give it a name, and where you put it is up to you. If I put it in my personal macro workbook, it means I could have a button up here on the quick access toolbar and it would still work, but the table and everything would have to be there. I'm just going to leave it default as it is there, and click OK. And now it is recording what I am doing. So first thing I'm going to do is highlight the row on this table, right click, insert and shift cells down. That will give me the space that I need. Then I'm going to highlight this area to copy the data, right click, copy. And then I want to click into the place I want it to go. And then I'm going back to home and I'm selecting paste and I'm looking for transpose as you see there look transpose so that basically switches it from a column into a row so that's just dropped it in there that's how I want it to be I don't need to do anything else if there was formatting there I might have to do formatting but for now I'm going back to developer and stopping the macro now I've already got a button there, but I'll use another button so you can see where that sits. So in the controls area on the developer tab, you go insert and the first option is a command button. When you draw this button, when you let go, it will show you the macros. So macro two is what I just did. So it's probably best to give these a name. OK, and then I need to edit the label. So I can just get rid of that button four and just put same thing, add record like so. And then when you click away from that, that button is active. So what I'm going to do now is change this record so it's obvious. So Delta 222, um, AS, loads of numbers with a Y. And it can be Mr. White or White and they're female not mister and then grade AA and they did equal ops and they are 23 so I've typed my record now I just click this button and it adds that detail at the top there and you can see it's been inserted with the rest of the table so that's a very simple process of how you can automatically insert a record into a table with one click so hopefully that video is of use nice and easy to do thank you for your time I'll catch you on the next one